welcome back to another Thursday cash stuffing video. Hope you guys have had a good week so far. Today we're going to be doing our weekly cash envelope stuffing. So we'll be stuffing our spending envelopes for the week and we will also be stuffing um, a few sinking funds. So um, first of all, let's see, I've got $400 that we're working with today. Um, so I'm not going to count it. I have like a ton of ones. Um, so it'll take a while to count. So, um, but I already counted it and I know that there's $400 there. So we'll start out with our spending envelopes for the week. Let's see here. So first up is, let me move that up. I think you guys can see it a little bit better there. So first up is our groceries envelope. I didn't have any cash left over this week, you guys. Um, last week, I think I had a dollar or two and I didn't have anything left this time. So that's the usual. I usually don't have money left, um, but anyway. So first up is groceries. That's gonna get $100. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, $100. I'm going in there. Okay, and then next up is gas. That gets $60 each week. So we've got 20, 40, 60. Okay, and then my daughter's piano lessons. That is $20 each week. So we're gonna put $20 in there. Next up is dining out. That's gonna get $60. So 20, 40, $60. that one and then next up is our spending envelope and it also gets $60 so 20 40 60 all right so that should take care of that next up is our spending envelopes um, so each person in my family we do a five dollars a week um, just towards our spending envelope so see here and I still I got to get some different envelopes because this is just not working because I just throw these envelopes in my purse and they're kind of getting bent and then like my stickers where I've got the names on them yeah they're falling off and so and I don't ever really think about it until I get ready to film and then I'm like you know what I still haven't figured anything out about the envelopes so um yeah I'm still working on coming up with a solution for that so um, anyway, each person here will get $5. So this is my husband, he's gonna get $5. So he now has 25. Okay, and next up is my envelope and I'll get $5. So I currently have five, six, seven, eight, and nine dollars. So I gotta get mine built back up. I kind of spent a few things this past week. All right, next up is my oldest daughter. So she's gonna get $5. And she currently has 20, 40, 60, 80, 105. Okay, and then next up will be my younger daughter. So she's gonna get $5 also. And see what she has let's see okay she currently has 50 150 70 90 um, 210 230 235 240 and here's for today so 245 46 47 48 49 50 and 51 so she has 251 in there now. All right, so that takes care of our spending envelopes for the week. All right, and then let me grab our sinking funds. So it should leave um, $80 to go into our sinking funds. So let's see here. So last week I didn't stuff these. The only one I stuffed was our car maintenance envelope. So I put all of our money last week in here instead of putting it in the different envelopes. So 
Um, I'm just trying to get that built up. So I'm going to do that each month, probably the first um, paycheck that we get each month. All of the money for sinking funds will just go into my highest priority sinking fund. So that way I'm able to build it up and then I'm still able to stuff the other envelopes the other weeks. All right, so first up, so this is, we, we put money in this one last time, so we'll pick up at the next envelope. Um, so first up is our oil, that's our heating oil. And I usually just roll the dice and four. So I usually just put in whatever I roll. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four. And we haven't like fully decided, but I think we're gonna go ahead and get some oil and just pay for it like out of our savings. Um, because we are starting to get like a little bit low and honestly we could we would probably be fine without buying more until the fall um, But we're just kind of concerned about it might get cold um, Like I know this weekend they're calling for snow here where we're at and So usually if it snows like even even though like it might snow and then it will warm right back up like our driveway um, doesn't get a whole lot of sun so the snow doesn't melt so we wouldn't be able to get oil in case we needed it and it does end up getting really cold um, so we're thinking about going ahead and getting that and also you know if we wait until the fall we don't know what the prices are going to do either um, so like the difference last year when we bought oil in the spring we paid like four hundred dollars for it and then when we waited until the fall to buy it again um, it had went up like for the same amount of oil it was like seven something so it went up like quite a bit it went up like three hundred dollars so i think we're gonna go ahead and just pay for it and then we'll keep saving this for the next time that we need it so next up is our eating out buffer so let's see it is getting four dollars also all right so it has one dollar so i'm gonna pull that out and just add a five All right, next up is our outings. I actually need to pull this money out because we went bowling last week. Um, we went bowling last Thursday, so I gotta put this money back because I, I paid for it with my card. So I gotta be able to put that money um, um, towards my card where I paid to go bowling. So we'll be starting this over. So let's see what we get today. So $1 today. Um, yeah, so we went bowling last Thursday and we had a lot of fun. My kids are like, you know, we want to go bowling every week. And I'm like, well, we're going to have to cut our eating out or something if you guys want to do that. So um, we were talking about maybe doing that like once a month instead of like eating out, we'll go bowling. So maybe, maybe that'll work out. I'm not sure yet. All right, so next up is car insurance. So let's see what it's going to get four dollars so let's see here I'm gonna pull out this one and add in a five okay so next up here is our back to school envelope and let me just move this cash because I don't want to mix it up with anything else all right, so back to school, usually what I do is I'll roll the dice, and if I get a one, it'll be the smallest number, which is 22, so two will be 23, three will be 24, four will be 29, uh, five will be 22, and six will be 23. So we're getting really close on this one. Let's see, all right, one, so 22. Let's go with yellow for that. So three more numbers left on this one, and that'll be good. Um, so at the end of this challenge, we have 528. Um, so let's see, 10, 15, 20, one, two. So there's our 22. And um, we need to save this money up because my daughter, where she takes classes, my oldest daughter, um, for one of her classes it is three hundred dollars for the year for just one class so and then we still have to buy the rest of our homeschool books and everything else so yeah I'm really glad that we have saved up this time and we'll have that um, because I didn't do that last year and it was kind of like a huge expense like all at once so this will be really good come like August all right next up is new phones and we need we need 16 to color in another um, icon here and I have five 
So I'm gonna put in $11 so we can color in one of these. So five, 10, 11, and then we'll be able to color in another phone. Let's see. So there is that, and let's go with green. So hopefully this one um, shouldn't take too much longer to fully fund, and that'll be good. And then we'll have that for when we need it. And my husband's phone is starting to have some like issues with it as far as like holding a charge and stuff like that. So um, we may end up like buying a battery for it and seeing if that will fix it so that we don't have to buy a whole new phone. So um, yeah, hopefully that works out. All right, next up is our Dollywood envelope. So we're gonna roll our dice and see what it gets. So $4, four must be lucky tonight. So one, two, three, four dollars going in there and let's see it has 20 40 65 66 six hold on let me recount that because i messed up 20 40 60 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 72 73 and 74 so we need like 26 more dollars in there so next week I may go ahead and just fully fund that one because I do have, you know, so many envelopes at the back that I gotta add back in. So I may go ahead and do that. That won't take a lot to fund that one. So next up is vacation. Let's see what we have. So we need 46 to check off another one of these suitcases. Let's see what we have so far. We've got 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. So we need $7. So let's go ahead and do that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you guys who watch regularly know that I did not check these off every single week. Like it just kind of worked out that I had the money there um, this time to, to check it off. So let's see here. All right. And we'll color that in. Let's go with this red. So yeah, no vacation planned. Um, just saving for when we decide to go somewhere. So. All right, so that takes care of that. Okay, next up is our land savings challenge. And let's see, I'm trying to get 50 to color in another one. So we've got 25, 30, so I'm not ready to do that one just yet. So I'll roll the dice and we'll put in whatever we get. All right, one, so $1 today. Okay, next up is our meat stock up. So we'll roll our dice for that. So $6 going in there. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, and then next up is our lawn mower. So we'll roll the dice and see what to put in there. Five dollars, all right. So one, two, three, four, and five. All right, so now we have 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, and 84. And I don't know why I counted that because we were gonna wait till the end to count everything, but that's okay. So 84 in lawnmower. Maybe I'll remember and not count it twice when I come back through. All right, next up is our giving envelope. Let's see, and it's gonna get $1 today. Okay. Next up is our taxes envelope. We're gonna put in $1 for that one today. All right, 
And then next up is Christmas. And on this one, to check off one of our icons, we need, um, I think it's 25. I actually erased it and I forgot to write it back on there, but I only have five so far. So I'm gonna go ahead and just roll our dice. I don't, I know I don't have $20 there. So $5, so let's see. One, two, three, four, and five. So. And eventually I will um, move this one up and make it more of a higher priority than what I'm doing right now. All right, so that is all of our envelopes. These are the ones that I still have to add back in. So let's flip back over to the front. So car is next and it's gonna get $1, okay. So when we made it all the way through, so that was good. Everything got at least some money. All right, so next up is our heating oil. It's gonna get $5, so we've got one, two, three dollars. So I will have an IOU there for $2, but that's not too bad. So first off, next time, we'll add $2 here and then we'll pick up with our next envelope. All right, so let's go back through really quickly and count everything up and see what we have. So car maintenance now has 20, not 20, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, and 59. So 359. So hopefully we'll get that one back up to 500 soon. Okay, so heating oil has 20, 40, 5, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, and 64. So, and if we decide to go ahead and get our oil, we may put that towards it. We may not, uh, we just, we haven't decided yet. So we do have money in the bank um, that we can use for that so all right eating out has five dollars in there okay and then outings with our kids has just one dollar in there now okay car insurance has 20 35 40 41 and 42 okay back to school it has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 35, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, and 52. So 452. And um, our challenge goes to 528. So we're getting really close on this one. So hopefully I can fund this one soon and um, fund maybe our Jollywood envelope and we can add in some of those envelopes we need to add back in. All right, so new phones has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 25, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So 240 in there so far. So that one's doing pretty good. All right, so Dollywood has 20, 40, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, and 74. So yeah, I'm probably gonna go ahead and fund that one next week. That way I can take it out. And vacation, it has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, and 38. So $138 in there. And I can't remember, I think this one, once I finish the challenge, is like around a thousand. So land. This one now has, let's see here, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, so 160 there, um, 70, 
70, 80, 85, 91. So 191 in our land savings. Okay, next up is our meat stock up. Has 20, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 47 in there. Okay, a lawnmower. We already counted that one. It had $84. Giving, let's see here. It has 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19 in there. So I'm trying to get that one back up to 100. And then taxes, that is our like annual property taxes, has 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. And then Christmas has, let's see here, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten so far. So it's a start. Uh, it'll take a while to get that back up there. Um, this tracker goes to 500. We saved that last year, um, but I think this year we'll probably up that to probably a thousand, um, just because the price of everything has went up just so much. So um, we'll probably do that for this coming year. Um, so let me see. I think that's all I have for you guys tonight. Um, thank you so much for tuning in for another video. Um, if you have any questions, comments, anything, um, leave in the comments down below. And if you're new here and you enjoyed the content, um, please consider hitting the subscribe button and helping me to grow my channel. I will see you guys back here tomorrow for our Friday night game night. Bye.